kind of person are you going to be? You're just James? a... Catherine? James. Catherine! She's in okay. cardiac arrest. Start compressions. James. Get the baby out of here. Move! Move! One, one thousand. Two, one thousand. Come on. Hang on, Catherine. Hang on. Okay? You don't remember you. one thing. We need a doctor, not a dead man. This one's on the house. Fail to meet my expectations no. and there will be no the James and his cheery charity. Decorations look future straight into the light right This place will feel nice. Just like home. It's just something you get used to down here. Come on over here, son. Come on. Walk to daddy. Just a little further. Over here. There you go. My goodness, just a year old and already walking like a pro. Your mother would have been so proud. Listen, kiddo, I know you don't like it when Daddy leaves you alone, but I need you to take care of yourself for a minute. You just stay here while Daddy runs to his office. You'll be okay, pal. I'll be back in a bit. <laughs> you are quite the little explorer, aren't you? Serves me right for trying to pin you in. Come on over here. I want to show you something. See that? It was your mother's favorite passage. It's from the Bible. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha and Omega. 
the beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. She always loved that. All right, come on. Let's go see if your little friend Amada wants to play. These experiments Don't be a damn fool. We experiment to prepare. We prepare to survive. Of course, I miss her. Stanley, you turned the lights on too fast. You blinded the poor kid. Happy birthday. Can you believe it? He is growing up so fast. Happy birthday, pal. I can't believe you're already ten. I'm so proud of you. If only your mother... Congratulations, young man. I don't have to tell you how special this day is, do I? Down here in Vault 101, when you turn ten, well... You're ready to take on your first official vault responsibilities. So here you are. As overseer, I hereby present to you your very own Pip-Boy 3000. Get used to it. You'll be getting your first work assignment tomorrow. <laughs> Enjoy your party. You're only ten once, so have fun. Happy birthday! We really surprised you, didn't we? <laughs> Your dad was afraid you were on to us. But I told him not to worry. You're so easy to fool. You're welcome. But really, your dad did most of it. I just help with the decorations and stuff. Hey, I bet you can't guess what I got you for your birthday. Go on, guess. Ha! I knew I surprised you. Who's your favorite barbarian? That's right, Grognak. Issue 14. And with no missing pages. I found this in a box of my father's old things. Believe it or not, imagine him reading comic books. I guess everybody was ten once. Well, I better let you get back to mingling with your guests. We'll talk later, okay? Happy birthday. Oh man, you got a pit boy. I wish I was ten. Hey, uh, thanks for inviting me. Really cool party and everything. I know that, uh, Butch and I give you a hard time, but you don't take that seriously, right? Anyway, uh, happy birthday and everything. I better get back to, you know. What, are you two best friends now? Hey, Enjoying whoa, yourself? I think Paul's gone soft on us. Yeah, nice Paul. Party. Why don't you introduce us to your new best friend? Who do you mean, dork face? Happy here? birthday, Sonny. Happy birthday, dork face. <laughs> Nice party. Attention, everyone. It's hey, time happy to birthday, Nosebleed. <laughs> no, wait. Nice picture. What is that? One of the 3,000 A models? What piece of junk? I think you have to wind it up there. Oh, no. So, what do you think we should call our guest? It's got to be totally killer, though. I would offer 